Hello and welcome to this Dr. Ross video on solving problems involving the cost of covering a fraction of a circle or quantity of materials needed. Let's read the question. Julia has a pendant with a radius of 5 centimetres as shown below. Remember the radius of a circle is the line from the centre of the circle to the circumference of the circle. So this length of the radius here is 5 centimetres. Joules cost $11 per centimetre squared. That's very cheap. Find the cost of applying joules to the pendant. Now, we're applying joules to the pendant, and for each centimetre squared we cover, it's going to cost us $11. So basically, we need to find the total area of this pendant, and if we have that area of the pendant in centimetre squared, we can just multiply it by the $11 for each of those centimetres squared to find the total cost. So let's find the area of the pendant first. Now remember what the area of a full circle is. If we have a circle of radius r, remember from the centre of the circle to the circumference, the perimeter, it's pi times by the radius squared. And we're going to have to find a suitable fraction of a full circle because we can see this is not a full circle. So let's find the area of this pendant. We've got pi times by the radius squared, so the radius is 5, so 5 squared. Now, what fraction of a circle do we have? Well, it's 270 degrees, that's 3 quarters of 360 degrees, which would be a full spin. And if you just look at it, and if you just look at it, you can see it's 3 quarters of a circle. So we need to times this by 3 quarters to find just 3 quarters of the area of a full circle. So if I put this in my calculator, I'm going to do pi, shift pi, multiplied by 5 squared, multiplied by 3 quarters, uh, and it, it's given me 75 over 4 pi, but let's just say I want that as a decimal, I can convert that to a decimal, and that gives me 58.905, um, and what's the unit? Well, the length here is centimetres, so the unit of area will be centimetres squared. So that is the area of the pendant. Now, for each of those centimetres squared, we're being charged $11. That's how much it costs to cover each centimetre squared in joules. Now, we've got 58.9 lots of centimetres squared, so we need to do 11 times 58.9. So the cost will be equal to 58.9 lots of $11 for each of those centimetres squared. And if I do that on my calculator, I can just write that answer times by 11 and convert that to decimal again, and it gives me 7127.49, and that's going to be in dollars. So that is the final answer.